the tape. Not his six years younger, has the height advantage. Brown for the IBF middleweight, Kevin Sepulveda. 71, 67 victories, 45 by KO. So with 31 consecutive victories, 21 by KO. An elusive southpaw with lightning speed, Roldan A by the IBF against the IBF middleweight champ round fight. You got five rounds to put this guy away. Do it early. Actually, that none will abandon his stick and move policy to house around right now for avoiding punches. It's very hard to try to land an occasional hard. That was not a knockdown, and that gives him the loss of the round. Well then 110 for Michael Nunn. A lumbering fighter against Michael Nunn. We'll see how the Tate fight. He has yet to prove that. Despite his slick, elusive style, he does have a 70% knockout of ours. And that is it for round one. That punch missed. That punch missed. There was a shot, and he uh, guided uh, former middleweight champ Carlos Monzon throughout his illustrious career. Title from Las Vegas for world title trim. Roldan involved in the historic bout back in landed several hard, hard shots. Remember, keep this in mind. It's a five-round fight. You get it done in the fifth round or else. Hagler back in 84. It was a disputed uh, knockdown. Roldan, a fighter in the truest sense, comes at you from on a national Golden Gloves runner-up at 19, alternate on the power. Roldan at 31, nuts. <laughs> There's no way quicker to get eaten up than to be the son as Hollywood's champion. Many celebrities uh, like a very sisters, hence the name Ten Goose. Is that uh, a brace of goose? None. Predicts an early knockout and he slips. Generalship, you're seeing it all here, folks, and this is what it looks like when a very thing. Uh, that pound for pound, none is the best fighter. Fighters, and of course today uh, the Mike Tyson's of the world and the Julio C. Like they're destined to meet. Evander's got some work cut out for him. With none just gaining more confidence as the fight wears the former WBC heavyweight champion. Michael Dokes will also be in that card. He's pressed because right now he is working like a puncher, not like a dancer. He's that stung by none. Roldan is fighting like a beauty. Is he Ooh, a left. just before the bell that, that slipped? This is what happens when you put too much ice in the corner and water. Whoop! He knows he can punch and not get hit in return. Roldan's third crack in a world time. Well, he'd like to meet either Barkley or Columbay in April. I'd take Barkley by right now. Some boo Columbay of the WBA and eventually retire as an under four scheduled for 12 rounds. Every round. And of course, in that other fight seen here on Showtime. Uh, like a map of the Massachusetts Turnpike. None put Tate away in the ninth round. Bruised. He just can't quite get to the taller man. Better. I tell you what I like about None. He, he is patient for him to get ghost sprawling. Less than a minute remaining, ready and fighting any different. Roldan, on the other hand, has no other way to fight. Well, he can't afford to get him. If he loses his cool, he knows that if he fights a scientific and intelligent fight um, for Michael Nunn, who has thus far pitched a shutout. It's the IBF middleweight champion, another shot at a world title. And Michael Nunn around the face, so Mike Diaz, the cut man, uh, wipes it away. But take advantage. Hit what you can. Well, I'll say this. Nunn has stayed, just stood still in front of him and let him come on. So how often you see a heavy puncher. Thing, missing with a wild left. That's something you let him roll down, get brave, and punch it. It's in, in fighting, gets cut because of his head. Because of the head. Blocked nicely. Just from all angles, he waits. He throws one or two hard shots. If they As well he should be. He's won four rounds without any... ...in his native land of Argentina. He wrestles there. Well, Dan with his left arm all the way up, his left hand. As he stopped the former Olympic... A bull of a guy like this, you get tired. No matter how sharp you are, no matter how good you are, those body blows hurt. To go. A total of five rounds. He doesn't look good. A one good shot can put the young... 
And round six concludes. He said he's going to go in like a kamikaze against Kinchin. He wants to win this fight as far as scoring. It's a shutout for Michael Nunn. The defending IBF middleweight champion against Juan Domingo. Right hand by Roald Dan just then. I mean, that's the kind that's on your chin. It starts wearing you out like the Chinese water torture. I tell you, I hate a fighter that wants to prove he's better as none stops being the super fighter. None with combinations to the head. First, but he'll be more comfortable at 168, I would imagine. Final eight is not closed. I'd like to see what happens when he fights in a different weight because eight in trouble the last time up. He is sagging a little bit, however. He's not bouncing up and down. He's scheduled for 12. Talent. But heart is there. Determination. By the WBA. Third time now, they have worn none for a low blow. And a right by Roldan. You can't fall. He's so tall. And his arms are so long. And this other guy is so short. Oh, and he's down. when he had it all going his way. Good combination of punches. The 32-0 with 22 knockouts, so 10 of his last 12 fights. Missed that right hand, though. That was not a right-hand punch. He landed that one. It's the one that just put the quietus on the whole uh, set. There he goes. Second round. 